There is too a fitness of time for any work for the benefit of God's human creatures. We are told to keep holy the Sabbath day. In what manner? Not by following simply the injunctions of those who bind heavy burdens. To say nothing about the same, but as a man is better than a sheep. But combining with God's worship, the most active vigilance for the resurrector from degradation, violence, and sin as creatures? In these cases, particularly was the Sabbath made for man and woman, if you please, as there will be those who will not accept the term man in a generic sense. Christ has told us, as it is lawful, to lift a sheep out of the ditch on the Sabbath day. Aye, a man is much better than a sheep. Those with whom I am identified, namely the colored people of this country and the women of this land are in a pit, figuratively speaking, or cast out. These were God's requirements during the prophecy of Isaiah and they are in full force today. God is the same yesterday, today, and forever. And upon this nation and to this people they come with all of their significance. And within your grasp are three to four millions in chains in your southern territories. And among and around and about you are half a million allied to them by blood and to you by blood. As were the Hebrew servants who came to realize the intensity of your hatred and oppression. You are the government. And what it does to you, enslave the poor whites the free colored people, the example of slaveholders' access to all. What would we aim to do is to put away this evil from among you and thereby pay a debt you now owe to humanity and to God. And so turn from their channel of bitter waters of a moral servitude that is about overwhelming yourselves. I speak plainly because of a common origin and because were it not for the monster slavery, we would have a common destiny here in the land of our birth. And because of the policy of the American government so singularly set aside to all free speech and free thought. As the law of God must be to us, the higher law, in spite of principalities, powers, selfish priests, or selfish people. To whom the minister, it is important that we assert boldly that nowhere does God look upon this the chief crimes with the least degree of allowance. Nor are we justified in asserting that he will tolerate those who in any wise support, 